Assumption Day. Como Marese believe that when the Virgin Mary, the mother of Jesus Christ, died, her body was assumed into heaven to be reunited with her soul instead of going through the natural process of physical decay upon death. Assumption Day is celebrated on the 15th in many countries around the world. In 1950, Pope Pius XII declared the Assumption of the Virgin Mary official dogma of the Roman Catholic Church. The Catholic Church teaches that the Virgin Mary, having completed the course of her athlete, life was assumed body and soul into heavenly glory. Father Edward Kabanda, the director of Chihuahua Catholic Shrine, explains more. Assumption of the Blessed Virgin Mary is the teaching of the church confirming that Mary was assumed into heaven both body and spirit. It, wo it would have been unfair, unfair to the one who brought the Savior into the world, Jesus Christ, to be left in the tomb or to die. So the assumption is a teaching that Mary was taken, her body and soul, into heaven by our beloved Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. This is our teaching and belief. And indeed, it is true, Mary was assumed into heaven. In the village in Fatima, Portugal, on May 13th, 1917, the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, appeared to three young children, Francisco, Jacinta, and Lucia, ages 10, 9, and 7, respectively. As was the custom, these young children were turning to the family's ship when a lady all in white, more brilliant than the sun, indescribably beautiful, standing above a bush, appeared to them. News from these apparitions began to spread throughout the region. The children recounted that the Virgin told them that God had sent them with a message for every man, woman, and child living in the century. She promised that God would grant peace to the entire world if her request of prayer, reparations, and consecration were had and obeyed. In major apparitions, we've been able to describe and to know how she looks like. That's why, for instance, the statue you see behind me represents of Mother Mary, how she appeared in Fatima. And they were able to describe what they saw and could visualize and put it into an image of a human person, which means it's not just a spirit coming, but both the body and soul in transfigured form, she comes and always reminds us who she is. Still in Kebeho, a small site located in the southern part of Rwanda is a best-known place of apparitions and pilgrimages. The first apparition of the Blessed Virgin Mary was on November 28, 1981, when Alfonsini Momoreke, a young student of Kebeho High School, saw a lady in incomparable beauty who presented herself under the name of Nina Wajambo, which means Mother of the Word. Alfonsini immediately recognized her as the Blessed Virgin Mary, the Mother of our Savior, Jesus. The phenomenon occurred subsequently. The Blessed Virgin Mary asked everyone to convert, to keep faith, and to pray without hypocrisy, according to Father Edward Cabanda. This helps us to know that as a pilgrimage church, we are going back to heaven. Even here in Africa, we know she appeared in Chibeho, and the visions were able to describe whom they were seeing. That's why these are some of the confirmations that indeed Mother Mary, like a Jesus, they have their body and soul in heaven. So that's why we always celebrate the assumption and to meditate how God is so good to us that those who have trust in him and those who always, always obey his will, they don't perish, but re they remain forever. So that's why we always celebrate this assumption to help us to know our journey that as a pilgrim church, we are going back to heaven. And we want also our bodies to be transfigured as that of Jesus and Mother Mary. So that's why we celebrate the assumption. Assumption Day is a public holiday in countries such as Australia, Belgium, Chile, Croatia, France, parts of Germany, Guatemala, Greece, Italy, Poland. It is celebrated with colorful processions, performances, pageants, and fireworks, but each region puts its own spin on the celebrations. Nora Osende, 
for you, City Venues.